In statistics, completeness is a property of a statistic in relation to a model for a set of observed data. In essence, it ensures that the distributions corresponding to different values of the parameters are distinct. It is closely related to the idea of identifiability, but in statistical theory it is often found as a condition imposed on a sufficient statistic from which certain optimality results are derived. Definition Consider a random variable x whose probability distribution belongs to a parametric model p θ parametrized by θ. Say t is statistic, that is, the composition of a measurable function with a random sample x1 xn. The statistic t is said to be complete for the distribution of x if, for every measurable function g, if e θ G T equals zero for all theta. Then P theta G T equals zero equals one for all theta. Display style text if operator name e underscore theta g t equals zero text for all theta text then math bfp underscore theta g t equals zero equals one text for all theta. The statistic t is said to be boundedly complete for the distribution of x if this implication holds for every measurable function g that is also bounded. Topic. Example 1, Bernoulli model The Bernoulli model admits a complete statistic. Let x be a random sample of size n such that each she has the same Bernoulli distribution with parameter p, let t be the number of ones observed in the sample. t is a statistic of x which has a binomial distribution with parameters n, p. If the parameter space for p is 0, 1, then t is a complete statistic. To see this, note that e p g t equals t equals 0 n g t n t p T one minus P N minus T equals one minus P N T equals zero N G T N T P one minus P T Display style operator name E underscore P G T equals sum underscore T equals zero carrot N G T N choose T P carrot T one P carrot N T equals one P carrot N sum underscore T equals zero carrot N G T N choose T left frac P one P right carrot T Observe also that neither P nor one minus P can be zero. Hence E P G T equals zero. Display style E underscore P G T equals zero. If and only if T equals zero N G T N T P one minus P T equals zero. 
Display style sum underscore t equals zero carrot n g t n choose t left frac p one p right carrot t equals zero. On denoting p one minus p by r, one gets t equals zero n g t n t r T equals zero. Display style sum underscore T equals zero. Carrot N G T N choose T R carrot T equals zero. First, observe that the range of R is the positive reals. Also, E G T is a polynomial in R and, therefore, can only be identical to zero if all coefficients are zero, that is, G T equals zero for all T. It is important to notice that the result that all coefficients must be zero was obtained because of the range of R. Had the parameter space been finite and with a number of elements less than or equal to n, it might be possible to solve the linear equations in G t obtained by substituting the values of R and get solutions different from zero. For example, if n equals 1 and the parameter space is 0.5, a single observation and a single parameter value, t is not complete. Observe that, with the definition g t equals 2 t minus 0.5 5 then e g t topic 0 although g t is not 0 for t 0 nor for t equals 1 equals topic example 2 sum of normals equals This example will show that in a sample x1 x2 of size 2 from a normal distribution with known variance the statistic x1 plus x2 is complete and sufficient Suppose x1 x2 are independent identically distributed random variables normally distributed with expectation theta and variance 1 The sum s x1 x 2 equals x 1 plus x 2 display style s x underscore 1 x underscore 2 equals x underscore 1 plus x underscore 2 is a complete statistic for theta to show this it is sufficient to demonstrate that there is no non-zero function G display style G such that the expectation of G s x 1 x 2 equals G x 1 plus x 2 Display style G S X underscore one X underscore two equals G X underscore one plus X underscore two remains zero regardless of the value of theta. That fact may be seen as follows. The probability distribution of X one plus X two is normal with expectation two theta and variance two. Its probability density function in X Display style x is therefore proportional to exp minus x minus two theta two four display style exp left x two theta caret two four right. The expectation of g above would therefore be a constant times minus infinity infinity g x 
exp minus x minus 2 theta 2 4 d x Display style int underscore inf t carrot inf t g x e x p left x two theta carrot two four right d x. A bit of algebra reduces this to k theta minus infinity infinity h x e x theta d x display style k theta int underscore inf t caret inf t h x e caret x theta d x where k theta is nowhere zero and h x equals g x e minus x two four display style h x equals g x e caret x caret two four as a function of theta this is a two sided Laplace transform of h x and cannot be identically zero unless h x is zero almost everywhere. The exponential is not zero, so this can only happen if g x is zero almost everywhere. Topic: Relation to sufficient statistics. For some parametric families, a complete sufficient statistic does not exist. For example, see Galili and Milledgeson, 2016. Also, a minimal sufficient statistic need not exist. A case in which there is no minimal sufficient statistic was shown by Bahada in 1957. Under mild conditions, a minimal sufficient statistic does always exist. In particular, these conditions always hold if the random variables associated with p theta are all discrete or are all continuous. Topic Importance of completeness The notion of completeness has many applications in statistics, particularly in the following two theorems of mathematical statistics. lehman sheffe theorem Completeness occurs in the lehman sheffe theorem which states that if a statistic that is unbiased, complete and sufficient for some parameter theta, then it is the best mean unbiased estimator for theta. In other words, this statistic has a smaller expected loss for any convex loss function. In many practical applications with the squared loss function, it has a smaller mean squared error among any estimators with the same expected value. Examples exists that when the minimal sufficient statistic is not complete then several alternative statistics exist for unbiased estimation of theta, while some of them have lower variance than others, see also minimum variance unbiased estimator. <laughs> Basu's theorem Bounded completeness occurs in Basu's theorem, which states that a statistic that is both boundedly complete and sufficient is independent of any ancillary statistic. Topic: <laughs> Bahada's theorem. Bounded completeness also occurs in Bahada's theorem. In the case where there exists at least one minimal sufficient statistic, a statistic which is sufficient and boundedly complete, is necessarily minimal sufficient. <laughs> Notes <laughs>